there is one thing that I like to do the most on YouTube and that is reading comments. I go onto different videos and go to the bottom and try to read different comments and that is a different type of a time pass for myself and I enjoy doing it. But my channel right now is so small, I hardly get any few comments. So this is my last video, two comments. The video before that, another two comments. Human post detection. Okay, I have a bunch of comments here. Thank you, and I'm very grateful. Even this, one comment. So th this is what my channel looks like. And if you look the other channels, look at those comments. And this is Tech Leads channel. And you just keep scrolling, keep scrolling, keep scrolling, keep scrolling. Well, the comments don't end. And that is what I am looking for. So today I thought, why not we use the text generation AI to create some comments for us. So I went on to Tech Lee's channel and this is one channel where you will find the most hilarious comments on YouTube. So just go ahead and copy these comments and I just simply opened up these comments section and I started copying all the comments in the Tech Leads comment section. So once I have them written down, I opened up a sublime file, a text generation file and copied all the comments here. So the first thing we need to do is let the AI know what kind of comments we want. So here from the original file, you can see there are some comments, some information that we don't need, like the name of the user, the time, there are some likes, the information about how many likes this came in. So all this information is not needed. So I started deleting all of this one by one. And one by one, we kept deleting deleting, deleting. Then I realized we had about 600, 700 paf lines of code that we had to go over and sift through to understand, to remove all this. So I wrote a Python script, a simple Python script that would read the file by using the F open command in the read mode. It will open up another file that we want to write the comments into and it would read through each line of code each line in through the text file and any line which is less than 35 it would skip if it is less than 35 or if it's zero the reason i put zero is so that each comment comes out as a separate comment and not as a paragraph so i put that zero to include the new lines as well and 35 anything which is less than 35 because the user names the timing the all that junk information that we don't need is less than 35 characters. So I just removed them and I printed and I created a new line for us. So once everything is done, then we are left with a simple YouTube comment file that we can now use for our program. So I have this up here. So you can see all of these comments are from the tech lead channel. So the other thing I did was I changed the tech lead to MISPA. I plagiarized all the comments. I removed tech lead and I put down my name because yes, the AI, I want the AI to generate comments for me and myself only. The next thing I did was I opened up a collab file. This is the collab file. You'll find the link in the description below. This is using OpenAI GPT-2 model to generate AI text for us. So the next thing is just go ahead and click on this and upload the file that you want. So I have this comments new.txt file and I just upload it here and we can start running. The next thing you want to do is runtime, change runtime and make sure you're on GPU because that is easier and faster to do and start running it. So he, over here on the second paragraph, the code, make sure you have the same file name that you're running with and just click on it and enter it. It'll take a few seconds to run both these codes. These are the two only codes that we're doing. And we are making the AI learn through 100 cycles. So it'll go 100 times over the text to understand and then create the text for us. So we are using GPT-2.generate to generate these comments for us. After a few minutes, this is what I was end up with. So you can read a few comments right here with me. The problem with politics is you get so worked up at it that you stop. I don't know if it's a tech lead comment, but then next you have, what I learned to code is garbage. Oh, wow. That's a comment. Mizpah, off 
get off your high horse and stop being clever. Good eye advice. Okay, that's nice. Everything Ms. Bas says is absolutely on point. Yay! Senior software engineers are really the gold mine of software industry. That's nice. Instead of giving them all the crazy little technical details that nobody understands. Oh, these are comments. These are nice comments. These are really looking like comments. This is the reality in most careers besides coding. Even right here is fast Africa. Oh, in fast Africa. I'm not sure if it makes sense. I've worked as an ex-Google, ex-Facebook, MISPA. Okay, all right, that, that's enough of it. Before we start flying, so with that, we come to the conclusion. I hope you enjoyed this thing. And uh, these are some of the projects. These are some fun projects that helps us understand the techniques, the programs, and the applications of it. And projects like these help us improve our skills. It may be just for the fun sake, but it helps us understand how the application works and how we can improve on it. There were many, many issues that I had to encounter while doing this. It's a simple application, but if you think about uh, how to implement it, there were very many problems. The number of lines that I had to write down, the, the script that I had to write down to remove all these lines, that went into many errors. So solving those errors, then the GPT-2 model initially gave me wrong, a, a garbage set of uh, values the text generation was garbage so you you went back and then changed the parameters make some made some adjustments so these types of projects even though they don't lead into anything they will help you in understanding and improving your skills so if you get a chance of doing something like this go ahead and i, I really i recommend and try doing that and of course if you like this video please do leave me some real comments so with that we come to the conclusion Take care, stay safe, bye-bye.